The automatic updates feature on your Mac is very convenient, but you may want greater control over when updates are installed. I'll show you how to gain that control. However, if you're not technically savvy, I would recommend leaving everything as is. Automatic updates, among other things, helps protect your Mac from security threats. That's something you don't want to leave yourself vulnerable to. Let's get to it. Launch System Settings by selecting System Settings from the Apple menu. Select General on the left side of the dialog. Now select Software Update on the right. Click the small circle containing the letter I to the right of Automatic Updates at the top. There are several options here. The first one, Check for Updates, should be left on. This instructs your Mac to periodically check if updates are available. There's no reason to turn this setting off. The next setting, Download New Updates When Available, should also be left on. This tells your Mac to download updates in the background. It doesn't install the updates, it just downloads them. This will slow down your internet connection somewhat while an update is downloading. If this is a major problem, then turn this setting off. But be aware that this will only be an issue when updates are available. 97% of the time, there will be no updates to download. The next setting, Install macOS Updates, should be turned off if you want full control over when these updates are installed. These typically require a restart. If you turn this off, you will be informed when the updates are available, but you'll have full control over when to install them. Install application updates from the App Store should be left on. This may cause an interruption if you're using an app that's currently being updated. In that case, you'll have to exit that app for its update to install. In some cases, depending on the app, a restart may be required. And lastly, install security responses and system files. Security responses protect your Mac from security threats. These might require a restart. But given their importance, it would be best to leave this setting on. If you turn this off or choose not to apply any updates when available, they will be included in the next macOS update. But keep in mind that your system will remain vulnerable until then. To exit this dialog, click Done. Any available updates will be listed here. There'll also be an Update Now button you can click to install them. If you have turned off the Install Application Updates from the App Store setting, you will have to install them manually. You can do that by going into the App Store. Here on the left, at the bottom, select Updates. Any available updates will be shown here on the right, along with an Update button you can click to install them. And if there is more than one update, there will also be an Update All button. Also. Any recent updates will be displayed here as well. Thank you for watching.